Hey, 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 hey guys, what's going on? It's the Rider 36 here. We're in fire. There's fire. Oh god. We good? Whew. And welcome back to Subnautica. <laughs> Greetings, survivor. Great job not dying. To assist you in further survival in emergency situations, you have been issued this personal data assistant. The interface visible now will organize your inventory, display currently available construction blueprints, and holds other valuable information. Ooh. Please take a moment to familiarize yourself with it. Ooh. Look at all of look at all look how good this game looks right now. Look at what they've changed up. Detecting increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with ongoing degradation of the Aurora's dark Ooh, matter drive core due to damage sustained during collision. Continuing to monitor. Situational assessment. Time T plus three hours since planet fall. Life pod hull secure. Communications. Offline. Hmm. This is cool. I'm I'm letting the game talk talk itself through because th that's just cool that they did all of this. I'm pretty happy. So first things first, we know what we have to do. But welcome back to Subnautica, everybody. And this is going to be my third playthrough, and it's going to be like hopefully a good one because I just you know want to be able to play this game again and this this over here is looks dope looks really cool this up here looks cool this looks cool everything looks awesome the new intro to the game you guys just saw it we're gonna go up and see what's ah subnautica the aurora oh. suffered catastrophic hull failure cause unknown zero human life signs detected in 100 meter range ah everybody's dead that's what that means but yeah, look at there's birds in the sky telling us that there's landmass already. You can see some creep vines over there. Oh, there's a peeper. Environment, uncharted, ocean planet, oxygen, nitrogen, atmosphere, water contamination, high. AKA, I can't drink the water. Got it. Oh. Game's already telling me to do shit. Copper is an essential component of oh, what is that? Equipment. Your probability that looks important. of survival has just increased by 11%. <laughs> nice. Alright, so there's a stalker over there. We're not going to go over there right now. I don't remember how to build any of the easy stuff. But look, this. it looks like it's got a little bit of a visual revamp. It looks good. Oxygen. Looks good. It looks real good. I like it. Alright, let's get in here. I just want to, I need to make, so what I need is a knife, a knife, silicone, rubber, and titanium. I'm pretty sure you get that Life from Creepvine Seed, okay. Thank you. We need a new name for her. I think I named her Karen last time for Spongebob, because that's what Plankton's wife is called. But I, I want a new name. I want a new name for her. Continued degradation of the Aurora's dry core may cause a quantum detonation. Calculating risk assessment. Death by malnourishment, 7%. By physical injury, 11%. By exposure to radioactive crash site materials, 19%. If the drive core is breached, probability of death increases to 65%. Well, that's nice. Okay, I'm gonna fucking die. <laughs> oh, that thing's gone. Oh, damaged. I, I need to repair it anyway. Oh. That thing. Okay, we got a med kit. Store that up. Alright. Let's make some silicone rubber. Alright, oh wait, how do... Yeah, we need that crash powder, don't we? for the other thing but yeah so we're starting off right away <laughs> magnesium crash crash fresh sulfuric powder and titanium magnesium where would that why can't i remember where that is i don't remember where that is look at that i'm pretty sure we built our base in the last game kind of like here 
kind of area, I think. Because that's a giant massive hole. Except for this time, it's not a lava. Yes, it is. There's the lava. Alright. Uh, but yeah, so. Relatively the same area spawn. Honestly. Uh, our base is probably going to be more over there. Because I don't want to be really that close to the stalkers like we are right now. Our life pod is... Uh, honestly... Oh, God, this is going to be annoying for a while. Oh, there's a lot to do. <laughs> I forgot how much there is to do. We need to make a scanner. We need to get titanium. Where's the scrap? I saw scrap metal around here. I need to be careful that I don't die right away. Because, you know, easily possible. I need to make a repair kit to repair everything in here. I need to make a base. So I need to make a builder. So we are going to just take it slow. I love the new HUD. It's looking great. Hopefully third time's the charm with uh, this playthrough. I'm going to try and do things in order, and it's, I think it's going to be fun. Were removed from standard survival blueprints following the massacre on Braxis Prime. Oh, wow. As an essential survival tool for 2.5 million years, the knife remains the only exception. Sorry about that. <laughs> Thanks. So we're not allowed to have anything else because apparently somebody started a massacre on another ship. I'm assuming that that's what that was. So we need to make a heavy. Local radiation readings exhibit characteristics consistent with total degradation of the Aurora's dark matter drive. Oh boy. A quantum detonation will occur with a probability of 85.5%. Advise observing a one kilometer safety range. Hold on. Is this one kilometer? Eh, probably. It's probably one kilometer. Pr probably. You know, we're fine. We're fine. It'll be fine. Alright. Anyway. Back to uh, trying to be alive. So, we need to make... Wait, we have a lot more inventory space, it feels like. Doesn't it? Oh, because I don't have any tanks. That's why. <laughs> cause I'm, cause you know I actually do, cause I kind of forget that tanks take up a ton. We need to figure out how to make. We need to make some tanks. Air tanks, glass. Okay, glass. We need quartz. Don't worry, I'm on top of the game. So we need to make an air tank so we can stay down for longer. We need to make flippers. So we need more rubber. Don't worry, I know the basics of life in this game. So we need two of these for one tank. We need, I'm going to grab one more of these. There's already stalker eggs. So that's always nice. Yo, yo, my dude's got some moves. You see that? Okay, I need to like... <laughs> Back up. Oxygen. Crazy rabbit squirrel with a fucking thing. Uh-oh. Go, 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 That oxygen meter is really cool. If you guys haven't, just like, pay attention when I'm underwater just to see what it does. I like I like this new HUD. Oh, uh, shit. Well. Here we go. Uh, boy. Oh, did you guys see that piece? I saw a piece fly off. Welp. That was cool. Look, you can still see lines from the explosion. That's cool. Ooh, look at all the stars. There's a moon. There's another planet. That planet looks cool. But look at all the stars. Well, shit. Thing blew up. That's a no good. Let's make rubber. We probably need two rubber in order to make flippers, I would say. Flippers, flippers, flippers. Yeah, two rubber. We need a tank. Ta-da. Nice. Okay. Uh, anything else that we need as of right now? 
Still suits, we don't know. Radiation, that's going to be important. We need that radiation suited ASAP. Uh, does it tell me how to make le wait, magnesium? Salt deposits. Oh, so I can just literally make magnesium right now. Oh, it's dark. It's very dark. What am I looking for? Oh, yeah, I need to get more creep vine stuff in order to make me enough for flippers so I can have a little bit more mobility. Cut creep vine with a knife. Okay, hold on. Oh, boy. Okay. okay I'll cut it with a knife. Where, where is that prompt? Let's listen to the prompt. There. Hello? Yo. It's early in the game. You want to fight me? I'll still do it. I ain't a puss. Let's go. Fight me. He's still after me. You want to go? Fucking cut you. Get the fuck out of here. Fucking, I'll fucking slice you to bits. Fucking piece of shit. That's right. You better run, motherfucker. I'm in survival mode. I crash landed on your planet. I'll cut you. Fiber mesh, creep vines. Oh, well, we know how to get that now. Okay, let's make some lead. Lead, lead. Ooh! We need that. We need the rebreather. Let's make some flippers. We need that rebreather. Wiring kit. Dive reel. Anchors to a physical point and unwinds as you explore. Oh, so you can go back. Oh, oh eh, it's a. Eh. Okay, wait, 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 wait. We need wiring kit. Wiring kit, wiring kit. Two silver. Fuck me. Fuck me right in the ass. Just, just take it. Look at my feet. Look at do 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 do. My dude's got moves. Look at do 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 do. Okay, I'm done. All right. So what did I need? So now I have flippers, so I'm a little bit faster. Uh, what else? Why? I'm... I don't want to go back in my sh in my thing already because I forgot what I'm looking for. But I think I need a battery for something. Uh, I think I might get another oxygen tank just to be safe. We need lead for the radiation suit. Titanium, I'll take that. Yeah, we need lead for the radiation suit because we can't go too far over there because then we'll become irradiated and that's... I don't know if you guys know anything about radiation, but that's fucking bad. It's real bad. Real bad, real fast. But I think I'm excited to start playing this game again I've been wanting to do this for a while I just have kind of been putting it off because I so if you guys are just go, coming in on this one I've had two other subnautical playthroughs at different points in the uh, in the beta alpha whatever you want early access builds and you know I've caught up to where they currently were so I didn't want to do that again so I took a I took a break from this game and decided to start a whole new world don't sing the song. I know you're going to sing this. Don't do it. Don't sing that song. Don't you do it. But yeah, so that's pretty much what I am doing right now. We need a scanner. A battery and titanium. Oh, I can do that. Uh, two acid mushrooms. God damn it. So, I know how to build a lot of the things. If it See, this is so this isn't my first playthrough. I'm going to be transparent about that early. Just, fuck you. Just so you guys know, this isn't my first playthrough. So, like, don't expect me to be like, oh, you know, if it's something I've seen before. I mean, I'm going to point it out to you guys, obviously, because that's what a playthrough is. But this game is awesome. So I wanted to play it again. I played it three times through. Like, that should tell you guys enough that it's awesome. Let's get a scan. I. That's a. I ain't got no titanium. What the fuck? Gotta give me some titanium. Hold on. Let me let me look around real quick. What the fuck are you doing? I'm gonna kill that thing. I'm gonna kill that thing. I'm gonna kill everything right now. I'm in survival mode. I crashed. An alien planet. Miles from or millions of miles from home. Probably. I don't know how far away I am from home. It does it doesn't tell me the shit. All I know is that I was on that ship. And we were taken down. But here we go. Alright. Yeah, this is literally where I lived in my second playthrough. Right over, right over there is where I lived. 
It's funny how it spawns you in like the same location. Not like the exact same location, but same general area. Which I mean makes sense. This area is called the Safe Shallows for a reason. I, I kind of am happy that I spawn here. Because you know, somewhere that has safe in the title. I'm kind of okay with living there for a little while. But I think we're going to make our base maybe over here. Maybe over here. There's some floaters. But yeah. So this is Subnautica. It's literally an aquatic survival game. Which is why I like it so much. Because there's all these other survival games, you know. But this one is in the water. Somewhere humans aren't like naturally made to be. So it's a lot more of a struggle. You have to worry about your oxygen level when you explore. You have to worry about other life forms because you're not fast enough to get away like this is as fast as i can go right here for now this is as fast as i can go probably sea glide fragment in there yeah so this is why we need a scanner because we scanners are allow us to have to uh oh, there's a rabbit ray egg scanners allow us to scan uh things from the crash site that and then we'll be able to make them later more we need more than one scan of course to make stuff but at the same time it's going to be really helpful when we do that but damn, there's like no limestone anywhere. Unless I've just been moving past it all, but I don't think I have. There's like no limestone. <sighs> Fuck. I need limestone, game. That will be there some. Yeah, they did change that. It looks very out of place, honestly. So what we are looking for from limestone is lead. Because I get lead, I can make the radiation suit, and then I'm not limited by the radiation zone. To where I can explore for resources. And last time I played the game, lead was in limestone. If it still is, I don't know. There it is, look at that. Right as I was talking about it. Lead knows right when to show up, doesn't it? Alright. Okay, cool. That's two lead. We're already we're set on lead for the suit, I think. Here we I can check while I'm swimming back. Blueprints. Radiation suit. Yep, two lead. Two lead, two fiber mesh. How do we make fiber mesh? Fiber mesh, crate vine samples, two of them. So we need to collect three, or we need to collect, yeah, three more. Oh, maybe, maybe we build, maybe we build like right here. This looks pretty. I like that. Like right, like off of that, maybe. Oh, hello, hello rock. But yeah, so I think that this is gonna be a good, good playthrough. I'm really excited. I'm gonna try and do things in order for you guys. I'm gonna try and make it fun. You know, I consider myself a funny person but again that's up to you guys because uh some people just don't think i'm funny and i don't understand them but i respect that it's probably because i'm a self-righteous asshole thinking i'm funny probably not really funny but i'm gonna keep on doing what i'm doing because i think it's funny and that's how you should live your life boom knowledge dropped fucker i will hmm Mm, you want to go? You're hanging around me too much. Oh, please come at me. Please turn around and come at me. I, mm, yeah, that's right. You motherfucker. I will end you. So, let's store, let, you know what, let's store up this fucking, let's store up this thing. I don't need that. Move that to one. I have custom keybinds, so that's why. I have to set stuff differently. What what was I doing? Fuck. Oh, uh, scanner. Scanner, scanner, scanner. There we go. Boom. The Hat Health Spectroscope Scanner can be used to synthesize blueprints from salvaged technology and to record alien biological data. Nice. So, she literally just said it. Scan. Oh, I can self-scan already? Alright, let's scan me. Signs normal. Detecting trace amounts of foreign bacteria. Continuing to monitor. So, I have probably foreign bacteria from the planet, I would say, in me. Because, you know, this is an uncharted planet. So that's nice. I have some unknown bacteria in me. By the way, you guys are going to notice that I'm going to be scanning every, like, every life form. I love to scan everything in this game. It's not only for me, it's for the fact that then you guys can kind of get an idea of what everything is. You know? And that's that, 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 that's another thing. 
behind the behind this game is that they they've made sure that you can you know understand what's in the game and that's another thing i really like about it because you could scan a lot of things so just so you guys know if you care i don't know if you do well dehydrate god damn it all right well we're gonna do this early i'm going to start my dependence on bleach not on bladder fish i need this so oh you cunt bag you tried to kill me i'll remember that so they're called gastropods i'll give you about one second to figure out why they fucking fart on you that's why they fart on shit to kill it see gasopod stop it Try, just trying to scan i'm just trying to just trying to scan you let me scan you I don't want to get too close to your poop, your poo clouds. There we go. All right. Uh, do, do, do we need to find? Oh, okay, withering weed. So yeah, I'm gonna scan. There's a lot to scan early game, so that's what I'm gonna be doing because I just like to scan stuff. And gives you a little cool little entry of its background. It's cool. I like it. I love lore in games. It's really nice. Don't you even fucking dare. Actually, no. Let's take this time to scan you. Come here. Yeah. He lost interest because, you know, he has the turn radius of a goddamn... F Jesus Christ. He's got the turn ra radius of a goddamn big truck. Okay. You're good. Ooh, salt. That's what I need. Yoink. Uh-oh. Um. Hmm. 30 seconds. Ow! You dickhead. I wasn't even looking. Yeah, I'm not really too concerned about them. But, I think that is good for the first episode. Life on this planet grows in unusual, distinct, and diverse ecological biomes for the study recommended. So that just tells me that there's more. So, like, there's the creep vine forest. There's the shallows that this is. There's a whole bunch of different places that we're going to be seeing. And different animals in those places. So, I'm going to end this episode off by creating some bleach. And then with bleach, we can make distilled water. And then with distilled water, it replenishes 40 of our water. Not really that much, but it's a start. And then, yeah, I think that's good. We'll make the uh, we'll make the radiation suit next time. But I hope you guys did enjoy. Like and comment if you did. Subscribe if you want to see more of my content. Subnautica is back. It'll be fun. I know it'll be fun. I'm going to just drink one of these. Actually, I'll drink both of them because these waters suck ass. But anyway, like I said, Subnautica's back. You guys can see we have 13 and 10 data bank, blah, blah, blah. I'm not going to read all that without you guys. So, but I will see you guys in the next episode. I'm so excited this is back.